Hi, my lovely Gemini. Welcome to your reading for month of December 2020 by Maya Inca Oracle. My name is Rika. I'm Croatian Psychic and Tarot Card Reader in Vancouver, BC. My dear Gemini, here on the table we have three packs of cards. And from each pack we're gonna choose a few cards to see what is to expect for you guys in this month, month of December, before the next year, year 2021. So, um, in the first pack, from the first pack, that is gonna be, that is regular pack, um, we're gonna choose a few cards, we're gonna do Celtic Cross spread. And we're gonna ask angels, those are angels cards, we're gonna angel, ask angels to give you some uh, information or advice for you. From this last pack, we're gonna have few, four cards um, in regard to your love, life, partnership, and um, intimate relationship. So to see what is to expect in that area of your life. life. Um, first, we're gonna choose one card to see what angels wanna let you know. Is there anything uh, Gemini should know in this month, month of December? Dear angels, let us know what is the important things, information or advice for um, dear Gemini for the month of December 2020. Okay, so uh, we're gonna see what is on there for you guys. Dear Angel, Spirit Guide Divine, let us know the information or uh, advice for um, Gemini. Your card for this month, my dear Gemini, from Angels is Page of Pentacles. Then we have those cards, a regular pack that we're gonna be. Um, choosing um, and make doing a, a Celtic cross. So first card for you guys is Ace of Pentacles. Ace of Pentacles is a um, card that is gonna be a um, main card in your uh, month of December. Everything is gonna be rolling around this. There is um, Ace of Pentacles. What is supporting you or crossing you is Three of Swords. And what is your underlying energy is King of Wands. What is getting out of your space this month, month, oh, 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 oh. Um, Queen of Cups is getting out of your space this month. And um, your crown this month is Seven of Cups. What is coming into your life this month is Devil card, Energy of the Devil. And you yourself, you have Chariot card. What is the next card? Next card represent people around you. Then we have a card that is going to be um, showing us what you hope for or what you have. Um, you hope or you are um, fear of your hopes and fears are eight of swords. And your outcome, outcome for Gemini for this month is a um, judgment card. Uh, my dear Gemini, now we have all cards on the table. There is spread there, so we can start with reading. Uh, we're gonna start from middle, from the center. So um, this card, Ace of Pentacles, it's Earth energy. It represents uh, some new beginning in regards to real life situation, real life. Um, it can be about job, business, relationship. It can be dealing with something from the past, um, something real, something real, but it is starting point. There is a possibility that you uh, get some maybe work or something like that. There is something, uh, some reality, uh, earth energy, strong earth energy. So, um, and this beginning. So with this um, can be some, some matter of dealing with something as well in real life. So what is supporting you or crossing you is um, three of swords. Some, you, uh, you guys, you, you probably have some relationship or something else that you, that this is time, month of December, it's time for you to uh, release some people or some things from your life. There is um, um split, there is split, you are uh, splitting with somebody. Maybe with, with somebody from your friends, boyfriend, some job, something, you're splitting, you are uh, leaving something, and but it's not easy, it's for you like painful and, and you don't like it, but like that's, that's this card is, um, is a, uh, 
not supporting you. This is uh, crossing you. So, or um, with, in another way, I can say uh, sometimes, sometimes that, that may be both supporting you or crossing you. In this moment, that can be painful, but in the long term, that it can be supporting because if you release people and things that are not good for you, um, they doesn't want to fit with you. They go a different way. They have different uh, lifestyle. They, they go a different way. You're gonna find something what is good for you, what is real for you. So, so there is some split that is gonna be influencing your um, current situation. Your something what you started in real life. In real life, you started something in real life. Maybe it's business or some some relationship, and you are splitting now this month. This card, not not splitting, but um, this card is um, the split is influencing your um, month of December. Um, so what is underlying energy? Underlying energy is king of wands. So maybe there is some uh, magical energy or friend, some friendship that is going to be um, influencing your month of December. And whether friendship or m energy of magic is influencing the, the big deal your month. Who is getting out from your space in the December is Queen of Cups. So this feeling like mother love and sensibility and thinking much about other people. So having lots of water energy. So it is getting, it is getting out. It's not going to be like um, influencing this month, month of December for you. This card is not going to be in. But um, you have still um, these cups, watery energies out. This month um, th thinking about home, about, you know, things like that. Cancerian energy is out, but you have still a lot of water energy in your crown. Your crown is um, full of water. You have seven of cups. Um, so uh, you have um, to make a decision and the crown is um, there. You, there is something about decision that you have to make. What is coming into your space, into your place, into your life this month is uh, the devil card. There is energy of um, binding with something or somebody that is going to be influencing your month in big way, in big deal. You want to be binding with something in your life. Your card, your card, your personal energy is chariot card. You are ready to move on. You are ready to... Um, you balancing, you, you, you are in balance and you are ready to move on. Whole movement. This is your energy. People around you have Knight of Cups. People around you are into energy of um, romance and love and invitation before uh, Christmas and New Year and things and holidays. You know, like it's holiday season and everything is like uh, in that in that uh, tone in that tone. So this is Knight of Cups. For you guys in your surrounding people around you have knight of cups uh, you can expect invitation and um, romance and things like that um, coming together but it's gonna be uh, it's not gonna be if you have romance it's not gonna be really stable it's gonna be like um i'm there for now and later who knows you know it's something like that um what is the um your fear your fear or your hope your fear is your fear is a uh, eight of swords. Your fear is to be um, not to be able to ac accomplish what you was planning, to be um, having some uh, barrier on your way to to be in, to that something is pending on your in your uh, life, so you cannot uh, do what you planning to do. So um, not being free and 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 not having free ways, so you can do anything what you want. Not being in position to do whatever you want. That is your um, being bound on something, being blocked, being uh, tied up, being uh, not being able to uh, to um, go your own way, but being depending on other or or being uh, um, blocked. So this is your uh, fear. And what is your final card, your outcome for this month, my dear Gemini J Judgment card number twenty? So there is a time end of year that you're gonna be dealing with some something you have to solve something with somebody you have to come to terms with somebody to solve some problems some situation you and other person or other party or other um somebody else is gonna be together facing each other and making some decision and solving some problems end of the year so my dear gemini i'm gonna uh, look those cards one more time some all together 
It's not all to all together seen. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, there is real an earth earth energy. Something is starting this month for you guys, but the um, energy of um, of split with somebody or something is influencing this start. Um, this start is influencing as well energy of the magic and energy on friendship. And, and the energy of water, water, or cancer, cancerian energy of Queen of Cups, um, cancerian energy of Queen of Cups. When I look this card, I always see um, Lady D. I always see she has lots of lots of water energy. Like she's, I think, cancerian. Not sure, but I think so. But the, she's like a person. Um, I can see lots of energy, or lots of, lots of water connected with her. So this is like Queen of Cups is about home, um, concerned about home, and you know, like. Um, emotional energy, lots of emotion and home and things like that. It is very important for those people. This is not going to be present in this month for you guys. And what is going to be your crown this month? Still, you have lots of water. You have seven of cups. But it's going to be um, thinking about some decision. You have crown. And that is going to be... Um, looking. You want to be looking. You want to be looking this month for... Deciding about something. And in your life is coming devil card. This month is devil there. So this this devil is um, binding you with something. There is energy of binding with something or somebody. In some way. And you are ready. You are ready for that um, move. For You are ready. You are, you are balanced. You... you um, can handle things and you can go on you can move there is a gonna, there is a chariot for you guys people people around you um have um energy of water again knight of cups this is um this represents invitation people are going to be inviting you um and um for holiday season for parties and things like that you can expect some romance and things like that but um you can, it is, it's like just time of year, you know, like you don't take it very serious if there is some romance. You, you cannot expect it's going to be like long-term stuff. Um, so, think. Um, and you, your fear is to being blocked, to being bounded with something blocked and not be able to move and to do what you want. And your final card, your um, end of the year, final card, end of the month, you have judgment card. Um, this, this month is going to be, um, f this uh, reading is going to be finished with judgment card. You're going to be uh, coming with some other party across you. There is other party together with you, across you. There is another part that you have to um, deal with. Something from the past, from the recent past, from before, from now. Some situation that you have to face and work on. It's not just small thing, it's, it's, it's bigger thing. So something you have to... Um, come to terms you have to some solve some problems with other party with other people with other person so this is your final um outcome and now my dear um gemini we have this angel card what angels want to tell you guys you have page of pentacles page of pentacles it's um earth energy so as we know it's starting point it's earth um of earth so strong earth energy it is that pages are earth and pentacles are earth as well. So there is some something um, that you there is some um, for you there is this month and starting something what you're gonna be um, having in the future. Something is there is some foundation that you are starting to build. Something is get happening or something you are doing. Something is going on. What is gonna be influencing your life uh, for uh, for a longer time, not just for this month. You, you, it looks like you're building some foundation for something. There is some foundation started. And now we have your cards for love. Love, relationship, partnership. Um, dear angels, spirit guides, divine, please give us um, cards for um, Gemini in regards to love. Uh, your, your main card, your foundation for your love life is tradition. And um, your partner has nine of coins. You yourself, you have four of coins, and your connection with your partner is prince of coins. You have again prince of coins. This is the same. Page of pentacles or prince of coins, it is the same thing. You, 
It looks like in, it looks like uh, angels want to tell you something. It looks like uh, there is something in in love life, in relationship that you're gonna be starting to build some um, foundation in regards to your um, relationship because you have you have tradition card number five. That is um, something what is to do with marriage, with strong relationship, with um, with binding with some people that are gonna be um, there for you for for life. So this is a tradition. It's uh, like Pope card. Is it higher often? Um, it's uh, it's higher purpose. You're gonna be um, your love life is not gonna be just um, I love you, but you're gonna be having connected with people that are gonna be having similar ideas and love and um, way of life and um, view view on the, on on life. So it's like you're gonna be having similar higher purpose in your life. So this is gonna be gonna be dedicated to each other and uh, true to each other. So this is gonna be um, for you guys. Um, for you, for some of you, it may be something to do with marriage or um, with engagement or something like that. But it's gonna be something about long-term relationship. So this is this month. That is something foundation, and it looks like you're gonna be starting building this foundation and um, starting some long-term relationship in your love life. Uh, um, so if you have partner or not, if you have partner, you're going to be building more and um, making it stronger. If you don't have, so you're going to be probably starting some new relationship. So um, your partner or potential partner is nine of cups, nine of coins, sorry. Nine of coins, your partner is successful, but is alone. Your partner is not really like going after other people and looking for love or looking for partnership or some uh, some person to be together no your partner is focused your partner in the moment is focused with um work and with success and it's it's for your partner it's okay to be alone they they doesn't care and they they're successful people so you yourself you yourself you are um you have four of coins um you are um you are showing off that something to other people um you are not as secure as you look like as you show other people there is something else behind that behind you like you are having some cover out you covering yourself out but in in yourself inside of yourself you are not that secure and not um that happy as you give out to other people that you are so there is four of coins you are protecting yourself some way you blocking yourself some way um but um that is as well um you're not letting yourself free to uh, receive love and get this feeling from your partner and um, start this um, strong relationship. But that is your your um, because of some reason that there is there has everything has is for reason there. So um, yeah, you you ma you wanna ma be sure you wanna make secure. You wanna be sure that something is okay for you before you jump into something, go into something. But you maybe should um, be but let yourself free. Not be so blocked and not be so like um, closed, closed off. Between you and your partner, you have Prince of Coins again. That is like I said, a message from Angel. You are starting to build something. There is Earth and Earth, like it's strong Earth energy. Something in real life um, is that you starting to build in regard to your love life. So you starting to build a real uh, connection. healthy healthy connection real connection a great love great um people so this is what for you my god my um guys this month for gemini my dear gemini um thank you for visiting my channel for looking um the video watching for supporting me subscribing like and sharing if you didn't do that yet do it now please and uh, see you next month next month in next year 2021 in january with new reading for you guys i wish you all the best in this year end of this year for holiday season have great parties and have a great holiday holiday season and um great start to new year merry christmas if you celebrate christmas and happy new year guys bye for now greetings from Rilke. bye